Peer, is there any love story bigger than us in the history of science? No, my love, there isn't. It is not only love, but also the respect that we have for each other. I can clearly remember the day when I saw you for the first time standing on a balcony. I am always grateful to Professor Kowalski for making that happen. Although you were 35 at that time, but you seem to me much younger. Your smile, simplicity, great passion for science remains the same from that day to this day. Do you remember? We were married in a laboratory dress as I have no dress except the one I wear every day. How can I forget the most beautiful day in my life, my dear? When we discovered polonium in 1898, Together, you were so happy. When you decided to name the element after your motherland, Poland, it gave me joy. Do you remember the night when we first observed the glow coming out from our discovered element? Certainly I do. You were the first to discover it and give the name radioactivity. Do you agree? Our greatest discovery is radium, which took us four years to isolate. It has to be as if we are working with 10 metric ton of a pitch blend. We are able to get one tenth of a gram. Beside a great scientist, you are also an ideal father to our daughters. They will always be proud of you as you are an idle woman from every point of view. In 1903, when Nobel Committee was not recognizing me as I am a woman, you stood beside me. It was your work. I was just helping. So I need to write to them about this discrepancy. Do you think people will remember us after we finish our journey? They have to remember you for your contributions and me as your partner. No, they will remember both of us together for our sacrifices and contributions.